Hi guys, welcome back to Simplistic Mystic. It's been a while, it's been a few weeks. It's been a wild few weeks for me. I had to buy a new car. My business has been taking up a ton of my life. It's also my busiest time at my real job. So, it's the holidays, so it's been a lot. So anyways, um, here I am. Um, it'll be a general reading, as always. It is general, it may or may not resonate. Take what fits, leave the rest, and characters in the story can always be reversed, vice versa. <clears throat> I have a slight pre-announcement. Um, so if you watch my videos, you know that I've been working on remastering my Love Oracle deck. Um, I just ordered from the manufacturer yesterday, but there's a four-week production time. So I also ordered kind of like a prototype from the company I use now, um, but I'm not using them. Anyways, I ordered several. I ordered 60 of them, prototypes, just so I could get them quicker. Um, these don't have the box. These are just new and improved cards, which I'll show you in a moment. Um, when you when when I get the actual manufactured version, they will have a box. But I want to announce these in case anyone's interested, and I'm using these in my deck. I mean, my reading today. So this is the new and improved Love Oracle. They are well. Let me show you. I'll show you my ratty one that I've had for two years. Um, the the fonts are a little bit different, and instead of just one word like all my decks are, um, so instead of this, I wanted to make it a little. I don't want to say more intuitive. It's almost less intuitive because I added more words. Instead of having a guidebook, I went with this option. So it has the it, all the fonts are different as well, but um. So I'll have the main word up top still, and then it will have some other descriptive words for the card. Um, so it's all the same imagery, all the same cards, but there's more information on each card, and they're a little bit different. The images are aligned a little bit different. The text, the fonts are different, things like that. So these are only available on Amazon right now. Um, several things. First, if you want the original, I have maybe 10 left. Um, they're on my Etsy shop. If you want the original Love Oracle, this is this is it. It's done. Um, so, these are on Amazon, and these are lower priced than the original Love Oracle because I'm buying them in more bulk, and it's a different company, so they're cheaper. So, these. Amazon, links are below. Um, there's maybe 40 of them left, I think. Um, and then... The next batch will be with a tuck box. Um, this is just a prototype of it. This isn't what it's actually going to be, but close. Um, these aren't even the right cards. These are just my other cards. Anyway, this it will be something like this. Um, not exactly like this. So if you want to wait for that, that's probably five weeks out. Um, if you don't want to wait for a tuck box, if you don't care about a tuck box, if you throw them away anyways, um, then... These are on Amazon right now. If you're interested, original Love Oracles on Etsy. Um, and yeah, 333. Let's go. All right. All right. Let's find out what is going on with the collective for today. What do we need to know? Basically, I wasn't even going to announce this. Um, new deck but um i put it on amazon and it started selling really fast and so i bought a bunch more of the kind of prototype version um because people were buying them and i'm like hey i'm not gonna miss out on this so that's what i did anyways all right oh my god that is hilarious you know just, i don't know if you saw how many times i shuffled that but this card came out, and I was like, eh, I don't know how I feel about that. Put it back, reshuffled, came back out. I should really put these cards in there. How are you not going to message me today? Um... Alright, 
So we have the Queen of Wands. Oh my God. Four of Swords. Nine of Pentacles. Okay. And Six of Swords. This to me feels like someone that is just like, almost like, almost like broken down. In, not in a bad way, but it's like almost accepting singlehood. Nine of Pentacles talks about someone that like has it all together, right? They may own a business. They're financially stable on themse by themselves. They may be passionate about something. It could be a business or something like that. They're a very passionate person. Um, but they've been doing some healing or they need to do some healing. But things are progressing. We are moving towards smoother waters. Um, anyway, okay. Oh, I should use my new cards. Duh. Okay. Alright, I haven't really hardly even used these yet. I'm so used to the other ones with the one word. The word is still there, though. I don't know. Do we like this font? I hope so, because I've ordered over 300 of these. <laughs> I don't love this font as much, I guess, but you can hardly see it on this one. Um, but the problem was I needed fonts that were not copyrighted. I don't think the one I originally had was copyrighted, but I got it from one of those free things and I didn't want to risk it. That was the other thing with this deck is I had to go through and make sure everything was not copyrighted. Um, and that's why some of my decks will not be coming back because they require extended licenses and I'm not paying for that. Um, yeah, so all of these fonts were from Google Fonts, so they're good. Anyways, um, anyways, I think my original fonts were fine. I probably should have just used them, but I was paranoid. <laughs> okay. First card out, soulmate. You may be, um, you may be like, like I was saying, you're single, you're alone, you're working on a business, you're working on yourself, you're chugging along at life, but you're like, hey, where's my soulmate? The grass is greener. You're like, I, you know, I wish I had that. If I had, it's always like, if I had this, I'd be better. If this was this way, I would be happy, right? <sighs> Reconciliation, okay. You could be reconciling with somebody. finances didn't I say you're probably working a lot um on material things um the nine of pentacles right I was saying it's like this is someone that's financially good they you know are successful they own a home the car whatever right I hope you own a car unless you live in the city um you know what I'm saying that's maybe the focus or that's the main thing that's going well in life um, but it's like, where's the partner, right? This is my first time reading with these. I like them. <laughs> I think they look good. I think, I think it's good. I'm so worried about like formatting all of these and making them all look the same and cohesive. Oh my God, it was a nightmare. Some of the fonts are not. Anyway, I'll stop ranting. No one cares. <laughs> um, you just want the cards. I know. I like to talk about my business ventures. Okay. Children. You could be focusing on children. Fur children. <laughs> right? Those count. Obstacles. Unhealed wounds and are blocking forward movement. Like I said with this four of swords, you maybe need to heal something within yourself. Stability. This relationship can stand the test of time, but also I think it represents stability in finances again. 
Um, but there may be somebody coming in from your past. You might not have dated this person. Last night it was weird. There was a lot of people um, that were appearing from my past. Um, they ran into someone. They live right near me. It was that weird. But um, also someone that I used to speak to via Instagram that I ended up deleting or unfollowing or whatever. Um, they, I hadn't talked to them in like five years. They randomly followed me and I'm like, hi. I'm like, I know this person. I looked back at my chat history and I was like, I remember who this is. But it was just weird. Like that could be, it's in a sense, that's a reconciliation. It's not like someone you dated or even someone I ever met. Um, but like, it could be something like that. It doesn't have to mean like, your ex-boyfriend of 10 years is coming back, right? Um, okay. These just fell out weird. I don't like to take two at a time, but they both like fell out and then went separately. Okay, that's interesting. Finances again. Okay, that's the second card that says finances. So this is you right now, working on your finances. Um, hustling, right? I don't think, I don't feel like it's bad. Let me ask, what's up with this finances? Divine intervention. Yeah, I don't, to me, this card is not bad. I know people are afraid of, like the tower card. This is technically the tower card. To me, that's always, it feels like an unexpected possible abundance or something. Um, and then we had balance that fell out over here. Uh, you might need to balance out that. Maybe you're working too hard right now. It's literally like 5 o'clock. Everyone's messaging me still. Friends and traveling. You may be going somewhere soon with a friend. That feels like a random side note. You could meet someone there. But I just feel like you're really like... There's a lot of, there's a big sense of like independence right now. Um, and maybe needing to heal something, but it's like, you're, someone's alone. All right. Let's pull a couple more and then I apparently have to get back to my real job. <sighs> Clean it up. Clean sweep, sweeping out the past, sweeping out the negative people, toxic people. I don't know. It's like, maybe that's why you're alone, right? Maybe you were like, I've already cleaned out everyone, right? This is all gone. Now it's just me. I'm left alone, but I'm working through healing whatever happened to me. Yin, yin and yang. You're looking for a perfect balance. Imagine you might be dreaming a lot right now, like with plans for your future. Poise and to be fair. That's the second card, kind of about balance. It has the scales. Maybe you're like, when am I gonna find someone that puts equal effort in? When am I going to find someone that is on my level? Maybe like. Oh, I've worked hard for myself. Um, why do I keep attracting people that are living in mom's basement? You know what I mean? Um, could be something like that. Anyways, that's all, I guess. I don't even know what this is called. A period of solitude? No one's going to click on that reading. <laughs> um, literally no one. Focusing on money, I guess. Anyways, I don't know. Go get yourself a fresh Love Oracle deck if you want it. This new one, no box. Still no box. Amazon. The boxed version will be coming in about a month to five weeks. And if you want the original Love Oracle, there's about ten left on Etsy. Alright, I will see you all later. Goodbye.